do we go to secondary? Correct. Anytime runners on base or there's two strikes. Okay? So the secondary stance, all you're going to do is you're going to give your sign, fastball, you're going to creep, pitcher's going to become set, and that's when you should start getting into your secondary stance when the pitcher comes set. Okay? And all you're going to do is you're gonna, your butt's going to be a little higher, your knees are going to go a little back, and you're going to be up. Because you got to be able to throw, get a block, do everything out of this, alright? Okay, go to secondary stance. So everyone, everyone give a sign, and then go into their secondary stance. Guys, on your secondary, you don't want to have your glove too far out because you can't move as well when your arm's straight out, right? When it's in more, you can move. You can go, go feel a little wider. Feel a little wider, butt up. There you go. Maybe laugh, now you feel, you can move a little bit easier. A little bit. Guys, uh, everybody take a knee. Take a knee. Let me show you something. Justin, come here. Take your glove off. Okay. Who's played the game in slaps? Who's played slaps before? Okay. Who's played this game? Who's played this game? Right? You guys see that game? Well, if you're trying to be as quick as possible, how should how are your bottom hands? Are they relaxed or are they tense? They're relaxed, right? Well, as a catcher, you've got 60 feet 6 inches, or for you guys, it's shorter to make a decision of whether I'm going to block or I'm going to catch whether I'm going to catch it high or it's low. It, you guys have a, don't have a lot of time, right? So how does this guy have to be in his stance? Relax. Relax, right? You got to be on your highest alert. The, and the quickest way your, for your body to work is for your muscles to relax. So if you're in a catching position and you're in your secondary and you're doing this, and you're tensing up like this, you're in trouble. Or if you're... If, Pitcher's out there, and I'm stiff arm like this. Is it going to be easy to catch? No, the ball's going to drop right down. Okay, so I need to be right here, nice and relaxed, and just have a little movement. It's okay to move. It's okay to move, but you just don't want to disrupt that pitcher. Okay. So now let's go back to the secondary, and I want everybody to feel their their bones and their muscles relax a little bit. Okay. Here we go. Go ahead. Give a little, give a little, a little rhythm. Have a little rhythm with it. Kind of sitting here. And that's what I do, I kind of have a little rhythm. So you're always moving, because you don't want to be stopped and then have to move, you know? You want to have a little rhythm so you're ready for anything. Try a little rhythm. There you go, that looks like you go. Good. How's that feel? A lot better? You can move out of that? Good. Okay, here we go. I'm the pitcher. Okay, I'm the pitcher. Nobody on base. Just go in your primary. I want you to visualize me throwing you a pitch. Okay? Whatever pitch you want. You call it fastball, curveball, slider, change, through ball, whatever you want. Ready? Okay. Give me a sign. Oh, I threw a ball. I didn't. Okay. Well, hey, 